Hey guys, <laughs> one that they say is Geneva 60 window. In the midst of this hardship, <laughs> the state governor of Imo State, Hofu Zodima, said that every descending Nigerian knows that President Tunubu's economic policy will salvage the country, and that is what President Bola Tunubu is actually doing. You know, you know, I've been saying this that. Uh, these people, they don't really understand what Nigerians are going through. You are making Nigerians to suffer, to go through here, because you want to do what? To salvage the country. Why you people are living in plenty? You are not going through what Nigerians are going through. So you don't really know what Nigerians are feeling. The first subsidy has been removed. Fuel is very expensive. Things are very high. Inflation is too high in Nigeria. Okay, let me put it that way. You understand? We know they talk about the dollar side. When they talk about the dollar side, the government can't float the, the Naira. Can't remove first subsidy. Life can't be difficult like this for Nigerians. But funny enough, politicians are not aware that Nigerians are suffering. Oh, they are just being wicked. I don't know what to say. Because how can a same person say this and they will tell us that, oh, you push your manage, no problem. It's for the unborn, the, the unborn children for them to enjoy. If we, when they are in an office, survive this, this while, and now who will burn those children when we can enjoy the, enjoy the government? They will never say the truth, even when they are wrong. They can never stand for the truth because that is who they are. Bad person, they be bad person, no matter what. You can never change him. All. That is the truth. Now say it take B. Person, when not get, when not get conscience, you not get conscience. You get, no matter what. Today, the former AGO of Nigeria said, the Nigeria has turned to international beggars. Nigerians, they have turned to international beggars because the federal government of Nigeria have let what they're supposed to do, then they busy, they attack people. When talk say President Bola Metinubu, they're not Britain for South Africa. When say President Bola Metinubu misstep here and there and all that. That is not the issue on ground. Let me tell you something. As far as this condition remains like this, Nigerians are frustrated. That is correct. So anything, anything they see they happen or anything hap that happened around Mr. President, now anger, now you, they, they, that is why people, they take the react like that. So with all these things, the government supposed to know that, ah, uh, my people, they are not, they are not uh, happy with me. Let me do something. You are not God that made decisions and you can never change. Even God says they make decisions sometimes. He go, when you beg him, he go change. He go give you second chance. You get. So why is it like this? You remove first subsidy for the betterment of Nigerians. But this is the worst, the, in fact, the worst ever government so far in the history of this country. But they told us that we know with his policies and everything, Nigerians go enjoy. So when you see the matter like this, you not go turn. Even when we see the ESA, the first subsidy say, they, you know, they again. You understand? Now, Hope Zodima is telling us that this is the best method so far. Well, make we just hear from her. Governor Hope Zodima expressed confidence so, that President Bola Metinubu can revive Nigerian's economy and transform it into the fastest growing economy in Africa. Anyway, that would be good though, but I don't know how they are going to do it. During an interactive session with journalists in Uweri, Uzodima donated two brand new 14 seater buses to the correspondent chapel and the National Association of Women Journalists, Nawoj, in Imo State. He urged journalists to focus on communicating the benefits of the government policies rather than emphasizing the negative aspects. And I hear so. Although 
the populace are experiencing economic hardship occasioned by the policies, they, will, they would eventually enjoy the benefits. Every descending Nigerian knows that President Tinubu's economic policies are sound and that they will salvage the country sooner than later. So, una de yes, so we don't know when that will happen. I pray that Nigerians will be alive when that will happen. You get. Because this the same thing they said during President Muhammad Buhari time, they have started the English again. Nigerians will enjoy last last. This is a criminal act. Oh. Hey, God have mercy. The same thing they said during President Muhammad Buhari time, they don't start the English again. Nigerians should be here. Nigerians should, you know, understand that President Muhammad Buhari is doing his best and is going to make sure that it's for the good of the people. And last, last, Nigerians, we enjoy. That is how it ended. We never enjoyed anything. But meanwhile, this government has made um, President Ebola Metinubu a superstar. Yes. They have made President Bola Metinubu a superstar. So, my dear people, hmm? make we just see how the matter will be and, uh, and uh, see how they will do things. They are going to do the miracle because with what is on ground, miracle is very, very far from these people. Anyway, I better make a drop out for you. Kindly drop your comment below the comment section. Don't forget to give her the thumbs up. Thank you.